Hey everyone, David Gossetti here, on my way to Florence Nightingale's place going to get my head to toe physical assessment. This assessment is crucial for admission into any medical facility because it serves as a physiological baseline for any change of condition. Was that you? Hey David. It's me Flo. Thanks. Hey Flo. Do I have your consent to do a physical head to toe assessment on you? Of course. Great. Now I know this isn't scrubs, but here's a little gift for you. Thanks for my nursing uniform. It's a blast from the past. You're very welcome. Thinking to myself, look at the patient for eye contact, appearance, hygiene and appropriateness for personal space. This general survey can often be a key to observing mental status. He is pretty cute too. Anyways. Hello David my name is Flo and I am a student nurse. I will be doing a physical head to toe assessment on you today. How are you today? Good. That's good. What brings you in today? I am on a secret mission to go to the past to visit key figures in nursing to share with everyone new advances in the field with an evidence-based practice in mind. Um, okay. What is your last name? Ghostedy. David Ghostedy, what is your date of birth? Young, but technically I haven't even been conceived yet. Let me see your wristband just to double check that your info is correct. Alright checks out, very good. Are you allergic to anything? Seeclor? 
What does Sekla do to you? It gives me rashes when I was a uh, baby, so I don't know. Do you know why you are here? Again, I am on a secret mission to go to the past to visit key figures in nursing to share with everyone new advances in the field with the evidence-based practice in mind. You got it? Um, okay. Documenting orientation alert times for David knows his name. Birth date. Why he is here. And where he is currently. Okay, now I will check out your vital signs. Which are your temperature, pulse, respiration, and blood pressure as well as are you feeling any pain right now? If no pain, would you say you have a zero out of ten? I'm feeling a zero out of ten pain. So, zero pain? 98.6 Pulse 71. Respiration 17. Blood pressure 120 over 80. Going back on pain, I did have like a breakup once. As for pain, I don't think breakups count as pain that I am assessing though. Okay, so the, as for physical pain, I'm feeling none. No physical pain, that is great. First I will check your head for any lesions, tenderness, bumps, and abrasions. Observing to myself. No pediculosis. Good David, no head lice. Observing the ears forcings of skin breakdowns or abrasions. None. Also, no cerumen. Very nice David, no ear wax. Next I am going to check your eyes. Thinking to myself. Pela 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 which means pupils equal in size, round, reactive to light as well as accommodation. Pupils are checked by shining a light from the side. Remember what you were taught incandescent bulb pen light only. As you view each pupil, note equality of size. When the light is shone, do the pupils react equally by constricting? Is the reaction sluggish, normal, or brisk? Next is checking the neck veins should be checked by having the patient lays back at Fowler's position or 45 to 60 degree angle. In this position, the jugular veins should be flat. Distended neck veins at 45 degrees are an indicator of overhydration or fluid overload. Next I am going to listen to your heart David. Observing heart tones are checked by listening to the apical pulse. Checking the apical pulse for rate, rhythm, and clarity of the sounds of the S1 and S2 part of the heart. Your apical pulse is 82 very good. Next. I am going to check your breath sounds. When I tell you to breathe in, breathe in. When I tell you to breathe out, breathe out. Okay, let's begin. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. 26 breaths later. 10 back, 8 front, 4 left, 4 right. Observing, very good, no adventitious sounds. Thank you, David. Your breath sounds are clear, which are normal. Next I am going to check your skin. Observing. Skin turgor is brisk and warm. Color is normal pink. Capillary refill is brisk. Very good David your skin is very elastic and hydrated. Next I am going to check your strength in your extremities. When I tell you squeeze my hands with your hands, squeeze okay. Okay let's begin. Squeeze. Very strong. Very good David. Very good David your neurologic functions are functioning correctly, no redundancy intended. Next I will check your bowel sounds. Observing from the right lower quadrant to the right upper to the left upper to the left lower using the umbilicus as a reference point.
that's good. Next I will check your back. If you can turn so I can observe you back please. Observing for pressure ulcers in the sacral area and any edema. Okay you can turn forward to your original position. Lastly I will check your legs and feet. Observing, no pitting edema or no edema. I will put my hands on your feet and when I say to push with your feet push my hands please. Push now. Yes. Very good, you have strong feet and leg muscles. Well that concludes our physical head to toe assessment for today, any other concerns? That I should know about? Nope, that's it. Well that concludes our assessment for today, thank you David. Thank you Florence Nightingale, it's been a pleasure.